explain all the rules of tarot. Here we go. Let's rock and roll. Hello, Sagittarius. Rambling Mike here. Going to play a little tarot with you today. Sagi Sag. Uh, I'm looking, you know, I'm looking for some love cards around here, but these are relationship spreads. So I can talk about home, work, family, the neighbor. I'm focusing on love. I'm going to get right into your cards right here, but you may get a different relationship story. All that being said, it's tarot time, Sagittarius. Overall, Sagi Sag, what do we got? Let's cut this deck. Looking for love. We're looking for a love story here, Sagittarius. Saggy, there's an ace that showed up. You know, that's about new. Um, air energy, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. Uh, it's a sharp sword too. You know, it could it could cut it could cut chains so that there can be new. Uh, it's a victory card. It's an epiphany card. It's an ace of swords as an overall. So let's get it. Can be some new communication. Let's see. Let's see. Let me get. There we go. There we go. Sagittarius. Give me a love story. Ace of swords as an overall. What is going on? Sagittarius. Here we go. First card out. Three wands. Who's this? That's fire energy right there, Saggy. Who, who's this? Who, who's in the ships over there, Saggy? <laughs> Is this Saggy looking at somebody new? Don't even have to be new. Huh? It's like, uh, well, I'd like the, I'd like, I'd like, I'd like these ships to come dock up over here. This can be a distance card too. Maybe somebody at a distance from your Saggy. Huh? Let's go, Sagittarius. What you looking at? The boats. The ship's coming in. Saggy Saj. Here we go. What do we got? Seven swords came out. Um, that's air energy again. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. Somebody's looking over their shoulder at some swords they left in a camp. You know, somebody's looking at some swords they left in the camp in this story right here. Uh-huh, somebody wants to go back and pick up some swords. Oh, the wheel. Sagittarius's wheel. About change for the better. Uh oh. Interesting right here. Let's go. Uh, the wheel of fortune, the wheel of destiny came out here. Somebody wants a wheel to spin again. I don't know. Is it Saji? Who's looking at the swords that were left in the camp? Huh? Here we go. Here we go. There's a major arcana. Justice. Uh, Libra card. Um, it's a card about balancing out uh, whatever Seven of Swords was about. Maybe been some kind of fallout at one time, Saji, you and a friend. Somebody wants those two swords. I did get a nice card behind it, the Wheel of Fortune and Justice. That's about things balancing out, right? An Ace of Swords. Let's get some more on this. Tell me more, Sagittarius. Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. Wheel of Fortune, two major arcanas. The Wheel of Fortune and Justice. Saggy. Saggy. <laughs> two of cops. Two of cops. I got my two lovers standing under the old oak tree, huh? K I S S I N G. It has a big healing caduceus on there. You know, it's, it's about a new start between some soulmates right here. Maybe in some kind of fallout with seven swords. Huh? Because I got five swords in the hand. So there may have been arguments that nobody ever won at one time. 
All right, all right. Give me some cards on these lovers right here, man. Got the Wheel of Fortune and Justice before two cups. Things are definitely out of balance here at one time with Saji and their friend. But somebody wants the ships to dock up. It looks like they're going to dock up with two of cups right there. Maybe, huh? Give me something on that right there. What have we got? Oh, look at 10 pins came out on three wands, Sagittarius, right? Oh, that's the quintessential universal dream, the little white picket fence, the big pink house. The loving power couple, Earth energy on that, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Raz, and Venus. Yeah, yeah. Somebody wants to go pick up these two swords that were left in the camp for whatever reason. Give me some on that seven swords, huh? Saggy, saggy, saggy. Oh, oh, see? A page of pentacles came out. That's a communication card. Huh? Hey, hey, maybe we can come out of these uh, choppy red flower, you know, these uh, challenging red flowers right here. Maybe we can walk past that uh, Japanese uh, cherry blossom tree of good luck and good fortune. Hey, maybe we can see the sunrise come up in the morning. Maybe we can go have some coffee. Here we go, Saggy. Saggy, Sag. Somebody's about to make an offer here. Be it Saggy or be your friend. I got the Wheel of Fortune, Justice, Two of Cups. Give me some on that wheel, please, Sagittarius. Oh, it's a uh, it's, um, little bit of air energy right there. It's the night. It's the night of swords. It's my dragon slayer. Somebody's going to bust a move right here. Somebody's got something to say. <laughs> Hey, it's the Dragon Slayer. Here we go. Give me something on justice, please. Oh, Temperance came out. You're Saggy's card. Look at this, man. To two cops. We got, we got a love story unfolding right here. Somebody, somebody wants the wheel to spin. They're not going to take no for an answer right here. Not with the old knight of swords. All right. Give me some on two cups. Two cups, Saggy. You got a love story right here, my friend. <laughs> There's a tower. Oh, man. Um, that could be about sudden change. Oh, ace of cops. Sudden change and a fool. About a fresh start, a new beginning. Somebody's taking a leap of faith here. Que sera, sera, whatever will be, will be. Geronimo. Here we go. Ten copper right there. Ten copper on this. Ace to a ten cup. Sudden change. Well, you know, these are cards. <laughs> these are cards of sudden change. Sudden movement. Sudden movement right here. Maybe somebody don't want Saggy to get gone or Saggy's got their eye, but there's movement right here. Movement. There's Venus. Libra, Taurus energy on this. Venus, love and abundance are on this. I like these kind of spreads. Got real sweet. A couple of love cards, please, for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. Sagittarius, a couple of love cards. Somebody sees Ten of Pentacles. Oh, romantic feelings. These feelings are real and worth exploring. Sagittarius, Sagittarius. Engagement came out. See, this thing's getting sweet, man. It's had Michael here for a while, I would say. Engagement. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. Ooh, <laughs> we got serious energy right here. 
For Sagittarius. Here you go, man. Here you go. This is healing for two of cuppers right here. Somebody's going to have to be brave and bust a move, but I see that happening right there. Here we go. Here we go. It's a power couple right here. Here we go. Saggy chemistry. Look at all this, man. Yes, there's a strong magnetic uh, attraction here and give this relationship a chance came out because this could be the one soulmate. Look at all this. Safe place to love. Well, trust is earned, huh? Somebody's going to bust a move here and try to uh, prove themselves. Um, it's either Saggy or your friend. Whichever way this is playing out with you. Give me a major on here, Sagittarius. <laughs> oh, <laughs> uh, that's a Capricorn card. It's a devil card. Yeah, devil card, Sagittarius. Uh, okay, somebody was acting like a fool at one time. Uh-huh, that's probably where they got put in the timeout chair right there. Anyway. Um, and the magician is all about new, right? The Gemini, Virgo. Uh, right, pure positive thoughts, uh, pure positive words, but that's just not sitting around on the couch thinking about pure positive thoughts and pure positive words. There's inspired action with the magician. Magician is a number one. Inspired action right here. Huh? <laughs> Oh, and uh, what is this? This is a, uh, well, it's Aries seated in their power. It's divine masculine energy has showed up here. Divine masculine energy is on your spread. It looks like they uh, may have been acting like a fool. Uh, but uh, give me one more. Uh, but it uh, seems that somebody wants to be a magician anymore. Yeah, star. Look at the healing energy on this. That's an Aquarius card right here, my Sagittarius friend. It's a card of healing and hope, great faith, dreams coming true. And, you know, it's kind of like, it's a destined read right here for somebody, for somebody, a Sagittarius out there somewhere. Anyway, it's beautiful. Uh, magician. To the star, the stability of the emperor is here. Divine masculine energy is on this spread. And there's the empress too. An emperor and an empress are on this spread. I wish you two the best. I see I see bells ringing over here, you guys. Soon and very soon. Could be sudden. Suddenly you two start, start hanging out and all that kind of fun stuff. Anyway. Saggy, if you're if you're still here with the read, thanks for your view. Appreciate you very much, and want to thank you uh, for hitting the like button while you're thinking about it. Appreciate that very much, and also uh, just a few short days to my meet and greet, July 23rd. Uh, it's going to be in beautiful Palm Coast, Florida. We got the community center over there, and uh, it's over by the beach. You can walk to the beach from the community center. Uh, it's a free gig. It's going to go from 12 noon to 10 p.m. I got a DJ coming in to dance the night away. I got a bunch of food ordered from uh, Publix. Uh, but if you'd like to bring a little something, you're more than welcome. I'll be playing tarot. Bring your cards. Free, 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 free. Looking forward to uh, hanging out with many of my Sagittarius friends. All the information is in the description area. See you soon, huh, Sagi? 23rd of July. Namaste, my friends. May all your dreams come true. Bye for now, Sagi Sagi.